Hi, it's Janie, and this is an e-girl makeup tutorial. After a layer of foundation, I'm concealing the places where I feel like covering up with a pot concealer. Then I'm applying a very bright shade of concealer in the center parts of my face because it creates dimension and brightens up the whole complexion so it makes all the difference. Then I'm shading all around my face and also under the jawline. Okay, that brow. So I was trying to do an arch brow, but then I decided that a straight diagonal brow would be more e girl appropriate. So I tried to conceal my brows getting in the way. I darkened the tail of the brow with a black brow pencil for a bit of a gradient and tried gluing my brows upwards so it fits the new brow shape. Now I'm drawing in a crease, but the first color was a bit too warm, so I went over it with a different one. Then I'm blending out the edges with a clean brush. I wanted the crease to be darker, so I went in with another darker gray eyeshadow. Now I'm cutting my crease with concealer. Then I'm patting on a vibrant purple on top, but leaving a gap on the top. a very pretty purplish galaxy and then I'm filling in the gap with this light purple shimmer here I'm just darkening the outer part a bit more for eyeliner I'm gonna do a very thick cat eye so the slope needs to be very very steep and feel free to mess up because you can always fix it with a bit of concealer. Also, I'm drawing in the new pointy inner corner and going over it with a liquid eyeliner to make it extra clean. Always remember to check the temperature first before bringing it to your eyes. I do this because I have really straight lashes and it's hard to curl them with the unheated eyelash curler. And then I'm putting on a spiky whole lash that I don't know where it's from but it fits the look. I'm pressing it in place with the tweezer and applying mascara to um, glue my natural lashes and falsies together. So this is like curling iron to hold up the curl longer because I have very straight lashes. Now I'm tight lining and I prefer to do it with liquid eyeliners because they don't smudge. Now we're gonna fill in and elongate the lower waterline and this has been quite a trend lately. 
I'm gonna open up the eye even more by applying a very light concealer there so it looks like the um, white of the eye. It's a natural but it's a trend. And then we're gonna highlight the Eggersar which is a thing we do in Korean makeup. It basically ex expands the eye area so it's, it looks like you have bigger eyes. But the first shade I used was too white so I'm just trying to cover it up with the purples we used on the lid. And I'm shading beneath the highlighted area to really bring out the Echo Star. And then some glitter because I love glitter. These are the small bits and pieces that I cut out from a whole lash, the short parts, and I'm gonna use them for lower lashes. And I'm applying a very pigmented a vibrant pink blush on the cheeks and my nose and also on my chin oh and also on the hairline just a little bit and i'm also kind of like overlying the lips just on the center for a super pout now i'm contouring my nose and what i do is i first draw m shaped at the bottom and then i shrink the sides and then i carve out the tip of the nose like in the diamond shape like a square then I shade close to the bridge and then blend it out outwards. And also above and below the lips for the super pout we're going for. Now I'm powdering and setting the makeup because I don't remember seeing an e-girl with dewy skin. I was highlighting my nose with a powder highlight, but then I thought we could go more extravaganza, so I took out this glittery highlight thing. I wasn't too sure what to do with the lips, so I'm just applying this whatever lipstick. Decided to add some purple to match the eyes. This one I'm applying only on the center because I really need to get this pelt for the look. Then I wanted to match the eyes even more so we're adding a purple galaxy gloss on top. But the look still wasn't like screaming eager at me so I'm just adding some heart to e-girl to look up even more and finally we're done thanks for watching and bye